Hi, I'm Chaotix, and welcome to Outliver Tribulation, an African culture-inspired Souls-like game, but with guns. The game takes place within an ancient, probably underground temple or ruins, but you get a sweet ancient energy gun of some kind. It's pretty mazy and involves collecting a lot of objects, but it seems pretty cool. So, let's check it out. There is a saying, he who begins a task should not be praised unless he endures and sees it through to completion. A long time ago, in an ancient Yoruba kingdom, at a time when men worshipped and revered the gods, it was customary to seek out power and protection from the gods in times of adversity. However, one such adversity set off a chain of events that would greatly influence the future of mankind. But for now, this is the story of Bolanle Boyega, a soldier who leads a special operations team of the Nigerian army, currently stationed in the northern city of Borno to help fight against the Boko Haram insurgency. Her team had been charged with finding and rescuing another team that had recently gone missing during an operation. But while on the mission, Bola's team was ambushed by the insurgents, leaving her as the sole survivor. She ran for her life, ending up in the mouth of a cave which collapsed, trapping her inside. Little did she know that her life was about to change forever. Forever. I'm gonna get stuck into that supernatural spooky ooky, eh? Oh, he's dark. Very nice, very nice. Love me some uh, night vision. Run time. We got a little backpack. Oh shit! That's a big fall. Ooh, is that a portal? Look at you guys! I don't know if you're supposed to be spooky, but you're kind of cool. And those are some very pointy titties. All right. Mm, the orientation. Okay. What is this orientation? Kaalea. Warrior's Orientation. Welcome, fierce warrior, to the realm of tribulations. A training ground where your wit and grit shall be tested and sharpened. To gain is to suffer pain, and only the strongest and most adherent shall make it out alive. The weak shall cease to exist, becoming one of the wanderers who stalk the realm till eternity. Great power awaits the one who perseveres. All right, so we fall and are immediately tested. What are you? You're glowing. Can I do something with you? Whoa, all right, dodge. Well, that's red, so that's probably the exit. You are green. The Enlightenment Orb. Oh, warrior. The Enlightenment Orb grants you the ability to know and understand the layout of the Realm of Tribulations. Oh, it's a map. You shall find one in every section of the Realm. Absorb them whenever you come across them, so that you may gain mastery of the Realm's layout and find your way around. A very elaborate way of saying, map. Got map. It's like mapping your head. That is different. Map inventory note. Am I in my words blinking? Let's see the way I came. I think. Let's see if I go up here. Okay. Yeah, it's where I'm. Where's 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 blinking? Okay. Okay. Barriers. 
in the realm, you will come across certain barriers that either block your access to pathways or essential items. Some of these barriers unlock on their own after certain conditions are met, while others will require you to have absorbed enough of the goddess's essence or to use specific orbs. Okay. Classic puzzles. Dang, no perp. So where do I get that perp? Oh, it's open now. Oh, that's a body. <laughs> yeah, they had not. Yep, yep, that's a dead body, all right. That was definitely the corpse of Boko Haram... F of a Boko Haram fighter. I guess I'm not the only one trapped in here. Gun! Plus one. Handprint? I lacked a hand. No, I need to get a jawbreaker. Now if I were- Oh! Wait a second. Hang on now. What in- What? What just happened? The Elder Gun. Modeled after the weapon of the great hunters of the past and imbued with the essence of the mighty goddess Orisha Oya. It has two firing modes, first of which requires a lot of spirit essence for massive damage, while the other requires less for low damage. Okay. I mean, right now I've got, I'm pretty sure just an AK-47. The Kingdom of Ilu Aran. Aran? A long time ago, Ilu Aran was one of the most prosperous Yoruba kingdoms. A kingdom known for its vast resources, commerce, and entertainment. People came from far and wide to trade and partake of the riches that was of Ilu Arin. Plentiful food and crops from its soil, spices, and brass from its lands. This was when King Onibode was a little prince. Alright. Now what the hell happened to me? Where am I? Is this like my... I mean, this looks like a hub. Like, like a little base, kind of. What do that do? Alright, yeah, I don't really want to read all of these. Ah, warrior enhancement portal. Red orbs and fists. Alright. Second Chance Portal. The Second Chance Portal, which can be found here in the Mystery Passage of the Central Hub. Okay, Central Hub. Grants you the ability to save your progress in the realm while also restoring your health. A warrior, always remember your past to safeguard your future. Keep your eyes focused on the goal for to suffer much peril and emerge victorious is to become a formidable adversary who is one with the gods. D so I died. I guess that's what happened. Okay, the warrior enhancement portal. Okay, these are describing the left and right. Use it to upgrade. Yeah, that's basically what that said. Hey, yo, send me back. Oh, shit. Now where am I? I don't get it. I was so close to the purple orb. Like, now where am I? Yeah. I can't believe Ibuka of Daga Squad is KIA. How did he get here and where is the rest of his unit? Yakuba, Elijah. Oh, Yakuba, Elijah, Idris, and Kate. Okay, well, this is clearly. Wait, can I not? Oh, there we go. More ammo. More, more ammo. Is this an, ar an arena? Do I not want to be here? Shoot. The Guardians Arena. Yep. Welcome to the combat arena of the gu Guardians of the Realm of Tribulations. In here, you shall be tested to verify whether you are worthy of progressing to the next phase of your trials. However, you can go back to the central hub if you feel you are not yet ready for the battle that lies ahead. You can always come back when you are fully prepared. 
hone your skills by defeating the wanderers to earn enhancement points that can be used alongside the red orbs to upgrade your abilities as at warrior enhancement portals may the goddess be with you no i want to go back to the main, main game I, sh what i can't leave oh god Oh, why is she all in my right ear? God. Alright. Whoa. Where? The sound's off. Oh, fuck me. The sound isn't very accurate. Whoa, God. Okay, this is... This might be easier on a controller after all. Yeah. I'm, uh... I'm, uh, not... not yeah. Get out, get out of here! Get out, get off! Shit. Yeah. I, sh I'm, I shouldn't be here. I should. I'm a level one baby. What do you want from me? I didn't want to go to no damn trial. I wanted to solve the first puzzle. Ah, I'm very confused. I feel like I just, I don't know, missed something very vital. Yeah, because I got nothing. Alright. Immediately going into a trial. Let's do it. Let's do it! <sighs> and an extra 30. So I got 90 bullets. I guess that would should be more than enough. Alright. Ah! Alright. Got it. Shit. Yeah, this is not much in here. Come on! Uh -oh. This is gonna take some tries. What the hell? Alright, getting a little better. Shit. Come on. I just need to get used to these controls. That's that's what needs to happen. Ah, right, you bitch. What? The, uh, the audio is so wrong, you can't find her by listening. It's just some bullshit. Oh shit. That's not good. That's new. So close! Don't die! I can't see her! I can't see her! Oh god, I, I was out of bullets. Or I, or I needed to reload. Oh, there's more ammo. Or, or they added more because I suck. Uh, I'll just remember where it is. This bad audio is so fucking hard. Got to draw my gun. Oh. Too late. Wait, too late. I thought. What the hell? Jesus Christ. I, I can't even hear where she is. That is like. Insanely. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Dis disorienting. Alright, here we go. Got it this time. What? Uh, 
there's no time to pick up. Ah, oh, shit, come on. Oh, come on. So close. Next time. Okay, I can see how it sows like. There we go. Killing it this time. Shit. Well, too soon. Too close. Just doesn't work up close. It's not enough time. Shit, where is she? Yeah, stay there. Gotcha! Adversary defeated. Well, okay. Guess that's that. Yeah, very Dark Souls like. Not really that difficult once you figure out what you're doing. Okay, so I am back where I was, right? Oh, uh, look at that. Okay. I guess that's what the skull means. Nice. Some upgrade stuff. I don't know what the white ones do. Or is that the jawbreaker? That might be the jawbreaker. Another jawbreaker. And another red. So how do I teleport back to the place? I wonder. The hub, I mean. Oh. What is that one? Omotoke. An epitome of the ultimate sacrifice. A renowned songtress with a melodious voice. A formidable foe with unparalleled archery skills. Daughter of Odorinde, Eluarin's most formidable archer, hunter, and warrior. Losing her mother at birth, Omotoke grew up without a mother's love but not without gaining her mother's gift of a lovely voice. Omatoke's childhood was spent learning to spar and hunt with her father, and as she grew older, she turned to using her voice to entertain others. Her dulcet voice remains unrivaled across the lands, and many gather to revel in the beauty that is her voice whenever she performs. Alright, cool, that's who we just killed. In an attempt to find her mother's people, Omatoke set out for Ileoke across the riverlands, but was drawn back home when the war in her mother's and her father's home hometown hit. After Odorinde lost his life in battle against the warriors of Otunile, Omotoke heeded the call for Iluerin's greatest warriors to sacrifice their lives in the creation of the Realm of Tribulations. Utilizing all she learned from her father, Omotoke sits as one of the guardians of the realm. O oh, ye warrior, pay you tribute to Omotoke, daughter of Odorinde, an epitome of the ultimate sacrifice and a symbol of a daughter's love for her father and her kingdom. Cool. I'm liking this. I don't know how much of this uh, lore, lore, bleh, lore is uh, based on any actual lores or if it's just um, it's more like mythology, African mythology, but it's pretty cool. Either way, I'm learning stuff. Uh, jawbreaker? Uh, that wasn't a jawbreaker. Let's see. This. That's not what I expected. Am I okay? <laughs> okay, that, that's a bomb. Like a keg. Alright, alright. Here's a purple. Filled with uh, writings. Let's see what this is. Not even get all the way through. The Kingdom of Ilu Arin. Prove your loyalty, loyalty to Ilu Arin, a kingdom known for its vast resources, commerce, and entertainment. Only then shall you be granted access to the doorway of your destiny. What's that mean? Sword, can I get that? Jesus, what? Wait. 
so it's a puzzle and you just get nuked if you're wrong man what ah uh, there was those things on the wall ah uh, th this was on the wall okay this was on the wall I was like what is that bandage uh shit I don't remember I don't think I remember seeing a horse. I think it was these two then. Okay, so those are important. Noted. Okay, cool. <laughs> I'm glad I paid some attention to that. I don't even know if I could go back. Orisha Oya's Essence. Orisha Oya's Essence prepares you for the imbuing ritual and grants you access to other parts of the realm of tribulations. Absorb them whenever you come across them so that you may be able to complete your quest. Okay. What you got for me, Orb? You are the jawbreaker. Okay. Got a beat. Need nine. Jawbreakers. Hmm. Okay, okay. Wait. Oh wait, but you needed a jawbreaker. Just bring me back for upgrades. No. Or yes. What the hell? Oh no, everything looks the same. You need nine jawbreakers too? You're an upgrade. Upgrade me. I don't know. I don't have anything, so I probably shouldn't even touch these. I got nothing. Welcome to the heart of the realm of tribulations. Okay, so this is going to be the, the regular hub. From here, you can make your way to the different regions of the Guardians of the Realm and obtain the necessary items needed to complete the quests required to progress your trials. Remember to use the Second Chance and Warrior Enhancement portals which can be found here in the Central Hub and the Mystery Passage as often as possible. May the Goddess be with you. Yo, uh, alright. What? What? <sighs> what? Oh, the body. <laughs> First Ibuka, now Idris. What in the world is going on? I have to find the rest of Daga squad and get the hell out of here. I hope I'm not too late. Note. Idris's notepad. On our way to the mission area, we were ambushed by the Boko Haram. We ran into an opening with the terrorists hot on our trail. The cave collapsed, trapping us and we found ourselves in combat with an ancient female archer. Sadly, we lost Ibuka. Shortly after, a huge guy in a mask came out of nowhere and attacked us, resulting in my injuries. Yakuba, Elijah, and Kate brought me here through some kind of portal. The monsters did not follow us here for some reason. Yak Yakubu advised I stay put as I couldn't stand on my own. He and the rest of the team would scout for a way out and come back for me. I hope they make it back soon. Whoa! Oh, shit. I sh that was a warning. And I didn't do any upgrades, nothing. Not being able to go back part really sucks. Unless... Oh, shit. Never mind. Okay, but... What does it use again? And spirit essence. What's what is spirit essence? I'm not even fully healed. Oh wait wait. Okay okay. This opened up. An attempt on Prince Onibode's father's life led to the banishment of his greedy uncle. However, a few years later, as fate would have it, Onibode's father got wounded in a hunting expedition. The king passed on soon after, and the inexperienced young prince had to take the reins of leadership. King Onibode had very massive shoes to fill as he struggled to maintain relations and respect from all allies of the kingdom. 
Oh boy. Oh wait, but the upgrades here at least do something with the gun, maybe. Yeah, I don't have these charms. Spirit essence and damage. Uh, so essence and you know damage. All right. That's the only thing I have, anyway. Do the. Oh wait, this might be where this might heal me. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Hey, yo. Now the hell. Welcome, Volanli Boyega, to the realm of tribulations. I am the keeper of this sacred realm, and I congratulate you on making it this far into the orientations part of your trial. A trial? I greet you, kind sir. I'm afraid I am lost, and I have no idea how I got here. No understand what this place is, but I would really appreciate being shown the way out. Hmm. There is definitely a way out. Everyone who seeks the ultimate power shall find it. But first, you have to prove you have what it takes by passing the warrior's tribulation trial. Only then shall the way out be revealed. I'm afraid I don't understand, sir. I want no part of any trial. All I want is for you to kindly show me the way out. The sooner you complete the trial, the sooner you can get back to your realm. My role here is simply to give you instructions on how to go about your trial. Once you are done with the orientation, you can go on with the other quests in any order you prefer. By the time you are done, you should have absorbed all nine essence of the mighty and powerful goddess of Ishaoya, which is required to prepare you for the imbuing and the final to your surroundings and be the fuck? under us. Until next time we hopefully meet again, I bid you Oh man, sorry about that audio cut. Freaking game unnamed or whatever. What's the word name? Oh. Who was that strange old man? He said he should only show me the way out if I passed the warrior's trial, which I really don't want to be a part of. What have I gotten myself into? Alright, so it wasn't a battle, just a greeting. Take these little boys first. Jawbreaker! Orisha Oya, the fierce, the tempest. She picks up tiny wisps of air and converts them into raging tornadoes, controlling the elements and making the tall trees bend in obeisance to her. Uh, I'm, that's actually a word I haven't seen, obeisance. When she commands, the clouds comply, precipitating rain and bringing thunderstorms and raging winds to the camps of enemies. When she comes, we know Sango is not far behind, as with a deafening howl, she fans the fires from his thunderbolts into a high blaze, raising down all that is in her path and sending fear into the hearts of adversaries. She is Oya, the ferocious and the fearless. The one half of a formidable duo. That sounds really difficult. I haven't played a Souls game since Elden Ring came out. You look. Get no charms. Alright, uh, um. Oh. Well, that answers that. And then these will be the gates. Whoa. Grapes. I'm, trying, I'm still trying to grasp how all this unlocking is working. Well, you need... Okay. Hello. What are the whites for? Required to uh, gain access to useful charms found across the realm. Okay. There's a couple doors that opened up. I mean, yeah, like that. But only like halfway? 
All right, well, whatever. What happens if I go to one? That's a jawbreaker. Okay. Okay. That gives me another white orb. Still haven't come across what makes me use those. Ah. Uh, nope, not you. I, I don't think I... I feel like I should wait because I don't have most of this stuff. I need to... Oh, but you also need those fists. Whatever that is. Probably something similar to souls. I don't know. Only one way to go. Apparently not. I guess out. I guess I just leave. I emerge as a sole survivor of the ambush and got trapped in this creepy place. Now I have to absorb nine essence in order to advance. No matter what it takes. I must make out alive. Okay, so I guess essence are the <laughs> that's what the jawbreakers are. Well, I'm still calling them jawbreakers. Wait, who's laughing? What's going on here? The dust doesn't help. Where do I want to go? I want to go left. I think. I don't even know what that compass, not not the one on the right side, but the one on the left with the blinking bow. I don't know what the hell that means. I mean, I already, I assume it has to do with the people you take down. I already took down the lady with the bow, but I don't know. That maniacal laughing does not give me solace. Okay. Well, got an orb. Maybe I could have gotten that red one. Shit. I gotta run back because I'm not. I have to be sure. Nine. Nine. Okay. I had a feeling, but it would have bothered me. Oh. It might be wise for me to acquire that healing charm first before attempting to absorb the third essence. There's no telling what might happen afterwards. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's what this is. Nice. Healing charm. Definitely. Ooh. Ammo. Healing charm. Drinking the contents of the green clay gourd restores health. Yeah, all right, SS flask. Gib, how do I get? What's that? Oh, the white ones. <gasps> hey, yo, okay. Now I understand what they're for. Yeah. Oh, shit. I don't have enough. I'm one short? How? No. Ah, the charms. Okay, an explanation. Within the realm shall you find the following charms, which will greatly help you in your quest. Igba Alafia, the healing charm. Igba Abo, the shield charm. Dagboru. The explosive charm. Agbada Ara. The lightning charm. Use the white orbs, which can be found all over the realm, to gain access to these charms. While you gain a temporary immunity to all forms of attack when using any of these charms, you can also make use of the warrior enhancement portal to increase their effectiveness. Okay, so you're invincible after using them too. That's nice. I might, well, I guess I could just put him in. Make life quicker, huh? Plop, plop, plop. Alright, we gotta go horseshoe left up. Oh, there isn't even a down. The Wanderers. Oh, warrior! Beware of the Wanderers and embodiment of the souls of fallen warriors. They seek only one thing as they endlessly stalk the realm, which is to claim more souls. 
Be wary of the dark. Keep your distance and focus on your tasks. So you do not become one of the follow fallen. Be rest assured. The wanderer's attack waves don't begin while you are reading notes. Don't know. That means as soon as I close this. And they're waves. I don't know what kind of waves that means. Timed waves, like they just keep coming. But I have ammo and types of ammo. That if there was melee, that would be fine. Oh man. I'm worried about the whole ammo thing. I never like being like a mage or anything because I'm so worried about conserving my energy. You know, or whatever the energy is. Your mana, your what have you. Okay, now that I grab the final piece, they aren't going to make it easy, right? There's... This would be the... Uh, Gameplay-wise, or game design-wise, this would be the pr proper time to send enemies. Keep you from getting something you want to get. Here we go. All right. Oh, oh, I have to look at my belt to know. So the gourd. The gourd is, yeah. All right. I'm just gonna assume. I don't want to waste it. Something's up. I hear it. Dust. There's a lot of explosive barrels here, though. Oh, let's get this. Let's get this first. How much ammo do I have now? We are loaded. Uh, never mind. Looks like there's a lot of things to get once you get all nine. It's a way to, like, get ready for the final encounter or something. Essence obtained. Now we can go through a couple. Now that I've absorbed the third essence. That's not a proper full sentence. I should be, yeah, the exclamation point shouldn't be there. Now that I have absorbed the third essence, I should be able to access any of the three guardian portals in the central hub. Yep. And we shall. Yeah, there's, now there's some fuckery going on. Okay, I gotta go. Oh, man, I wish I was... Oh, okay, I see, I see. Oh, Essence recharges? This is fine. This is fine. Whoa! That's not fine! Oh, God. No, this is not fine. I'm doing not fine at all. I'm doing very not fine. Oh, no. Oh, and if you use it all, you have to wait for it to fully recharge. This is not good. Holy shit. Uh, oh, and it's it's a cooldown. <gasps> okay, everything is different. The whole game changed to me now. This is awesome. I mean, I'm not doing great. But, uh... So I could just hang out for a second and wait to be able to heal myself. Wow, okay, the real game has started. Oh, it only does like a, a, a quarter or a third. All right, definitely take it slow. Takes a whole minute.
the wave, so that changed it completely. Clearly. Yep. I'm not making progress at this rate. Okay. Shit. Oh, it's 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 such a major game changer then because of the, if the waves are timed and they're endless, but that's why you have. Okay, shit. So, oh man, that's. So, I don't know which. I don't know if I like that. All right, rush it, rush it. The quests. If I remember correctly, the keeper said I can choose to go about the quests in any order I prefer. Egg. The mother hen. Ah, fitting. A mother hen watches over her chicks and guards her eggs. The present was an egg laid by the past that had the future in its shell. Four they were and four they must be. Head to the region of the sword wielding guardian. Akinolu to obtain the items required to complete this quest. Alright, that's finding four eggs. Okay. I have three choices. It still doesn't feel like it. Okay, there's that one. Sword. Oh. Probably the ones highlighted at the top. Yes, 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 yes. Well. Since I already opened it, I don't want to over confuse myself. This controller better not be the death of me. Let's go! I forgot to heal. Oh, yeah, and a little upgrade. Potency. And. Yep, I think those are souls. Let's try. Oh, and each world has its own map, that's right. Quest objectives! Get the purple orb from the Guardian's chamber and use it to ac gain access to the riddle room. Solve the riddle to gain access to the green orbs and use them to obtain the quest items. Head back to the central hub to complete the chosen quest. Optional. Pick up the white orbs and use them to obtain new charms from the charm rooms. Battle against the wanderers to earn warrior enhancement points which can be used along with the red orbs to upgrade your abilities at the warrior enhancement portals. Warrior enhancement points. Okay, those are the fists, I think. All right. Want the white. Got orb. Shit, shit, shit. Where? Where? I, I hear you. Blocked out the light. All right, so we got to wait. Oh, it gives it, it gave it to me right away. Okay, 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 okay. Um, yeah, I guess we'll head left. Get you. Shit. Then we need. Okay, fine, fine. We're just gonna go in this direction, I guess. What is this? What do you need? Shit. It's a charm room. Explosive charm. Smashing the shell on the ground sends explosive shock waves that was stun. Okay. Let's go for close proximity like that. The, the fuck off charm. No! Alright, I'm getting a bit of a hang of it. Shit. Whoa! Why did she put her gun away? No! I need my gun! What are you doing? No, stop what, at all what I said! It was going so fine! Alright, fine, whatever. Oh, 
What's where, where's my gun? You stupid You stupid mechanic. I don't know what the hell happened there. Oh my god. It was going so fine and then I, I really don't know what even happened. I'm gonna have to review that. What the hell? Alright, so this needs another eight. And a green orb. And there's only four here, so I I'll have to end up coming back. No, but I need the egg. Oh, just for the green orb, I guess. Or just the green orb is needed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's fine. Whoa. What are you? Freaky grandma. Wait, hang on. This is not how you're supposed to behave. Wow. I, it's, it's kind of really fucked that they spawn completely surrounding you. There's unforgiving and completely unfair. Akinolu, the most powerful of the war chiefs Ilu Arin has ever seen, believed by many to be as strong as a demigod. At the young age of 17, he took part in the Ilu Arin Alagato War, which saw him gain fame for defeating Alagato's most fearsome warrior and sorcerer, Dagunduro. Following the feat, he was crowned Ilu Arin's war chief. The youngest war chief ever crowned, earning him de derision from the older titled chiefs of the political class. However, the young war chief handled his office so well, everybody was soon won over. Cool. Good job. Fucking hell. Alright. Guess we're doing this now. Hmm. At least they accumulate. Ah, shit. Here we go. It's just the grain stuff again. Ah, no! Akinolu! They didn't do any softening, but damn aiming. Okay, he's not so bad. Melee is a lot easier to predict. And dodge. Come on, here we go, Akinolu. 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 Shit. Shit. Nope, that, that was fairly mighty. Uh, do I heal now so it can replenish in time? Yeah, now I do. Yeah, some weird... This is weird. Alright. He fires bombs from his armpits. No! Not the armpits! Woo! No, don't do it! No, don't do it! Take that. Hehe. <laughs> Bitch. Whoa! Not the armpits! I gotta remember the armpits. Damn it. I, that's... Ah. Uh, not even halfway. Uh, 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 uh. Come on, Akinolu. Uh, 
Let's go, big boy. There you are. Totally unfair with your terrible audio, by the way. I'm still on that. If I can hear where he is, I can dodge when I don't see him. Like that bullshit. Whoa! Oh, that's not... That's not cool. None of the audio makes sense. It's, that's my biggest... That's my biggest critique. Is this stupid fucking audio. This game is ridiculous. I oh, I'm trying one more time this for for, for this session. Akinolu, Akino, you. Run. Ah, shit. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, no. There we go. Ah, oh, shit. No. I lied one more time. Now that I actually found a new groove. Alright, Aki know you. What you got? You got a big sword. Looks like a big butter knife. Ah, damn it, I didn't follow my own rule. I broke my own rule and now I got hit. No greedy, no greedy. Come here. There we go. No! I'm too close! That's not fair! I can't even dodge them. If I'm that close, it's literally impossible. Alright, well, fuck that. Um, this game actually uh, is kind of proving why it, it is essential for games to have at least a few iframes uh, in vulnerability frames during dodging or something just because well as you saw right there i was so close to the blast radius of his armpit blasts that it was completely impossible to dodge and i was just doomed just by being close and he spawned close to me anyway there just wasn't anything in my power as as a player to really do anything about it uh, I guess I guess I could have tried healing because that's the only thing I know right now that makes you invincible but it's not really justified I'm gonna leave it here for now but yeah um it's definitely a really good game I expected less not knowing anything about the game other than it being independent and I thought it would be more horror than it is it's not but that's fine yeah so outliver tribulation pretty good definitely souls like filled with trials seems like a couple puzzles waves of monsters to balance the fact that you have timed abilities timed healing timed energy for your gun that kind of thing 
kind of makes sense with timed waves of enemies. But, um, I think it's pretty good. It's definitely frustrating like any other Souls-like game. And that's it. Bye-bye!